Hey Sabre Nation, this is Brenton Isaac, and uh, today we're covering the topic of underclassmen getting their licenses. As you know, a lot of people are fed up with uh, sophomore driving and them clogging up the parking lot and how it takes an eternity to leave the parking lot at the end of the school day. So we're going to interview some, uh, some of the students to see what their opinion is. And we do have to keep in mind here that uh, the underclassmen are inexperienced drivers, so it's not necessarily their fault. We're just merely covering the, uh, the opinion of the student body and the faculty. All right, thank you. Hey guys, this is Grant Hamilton reporting from Sabre TV on the, 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 the inside scoop about how sophomores are just crowding up this, uh, the, the parking lot outside there. And so uh, we have an enraged uh, junior, Nick Manning, and he's just gonna tell us some feelings about uh, how insane these sophomores are this year with their parking. Yeah, hey guys, what's up? It's me, Nick. Um, I'm not very happy about the sophomores um, taking all of our spots in the main lot this oh, year. Yeah. And I think it's ridiculous that um, I had to park down in the west lot just because the um, sophomores are parked up in that lot. Thank you. Yeah, well, it's been great sitting down with you, dude. You have a great day. Yeah. Hey Sabre TV, I'm here with Jake Schrammel on the subject of underclassmen in the parking lot. What are your views, Jake? Uh, Isaac, I don't really care that much because I don't park in the main parking lot anyway, okay. so okay. it doesn't affect me at all. Sure, sure. Well, that's, some, that's some good input. Thanks yep. for uh, sitting down with us. Yep. You have a good one. Yeah, I'm here with Andrew Grant uh, on Sabre TV just talking about how the sophomores just keep ruining the lot, overcrowding it, and just causing a lot of havoc. Please tell us about it. Well, you know, I gotta wash my back every time I walk out of school, you know, I gotta run my car pretty much before the sophomores almost hit me. And, you know, I just can't really get out of my parking spot because they're driving like crazy animals. I agree, dude. Yeah, it's crazy out there in the field, you know? Yeah, I feel well, you. Great sitting down with you, man. Thank you. Alright, I'm here with Chase Anderson on the subject of underclassmen driving in the parking lot. What's your stance, Chase? Uh... I don't know. Ew. All right, I'm Brent Walters with Saber TV. I'm here with Matt Eisenshank, aka Diesel. So, uh, what's your uh, take on the sophomores overloading the parking lot? Well, it's really chaotic, especially trying to leave. And then, quite frequently, I park next to sophomores, and they tend to crowd over into my space. It's not, not cool. That's horrible because that's how you get door dings. When you open up your door, and then oh yeah, I bet that there's countless of those on your tire because of. Uh, not yet, but there probably will be. Oh yeah, alright. Signing off. Thanks for sitting down with us, Diesel. Yeah. Alright, I'm here with Michael Volgman Mercury on the subject of underclassmen in the parking lot. What's your view, Michael? Well, I park in the west lot, so I don't really have to deal too much with problems like people taking my spot or anything okay. like that. Okay. Um, it's not really a huge issue for me. Sure, sure. Um, I can see how it could be for people in the main lot, though. So, okay, okay. You know, I don't have to deal with too many problems. No, yeah, I understand. All right, uh, thanks for your time, Michael. Yep, no problem. All right, now we have Hannah with us to discuss her uh, almost car accident because of the sophomores. <laughs> oh, the sophomores do not know the ins and outs yet. They don't know that you're supposed to let one car go. They didn't let me go. So I almost got in a car crash on the second day of school, and it was very sad. Sweet, so thanks for uh, joining us. No problem. Hey guys, this is Grant Hamilton reporting from Sabre TV with uh, my friend Ian Weber. But he's just going to tell us a little bit about how uh, uh, sophomores are just really crowding up the parking lot. And so how do you feel about that? I don't drive, so I, I have no feeling. <laughs> I appreciate it. Appreciate hey, you too. Yeah. All right, hi everyone, I'm Brent Walters with the Saber TV. I'm here with Mr. Hiltner, a great math teacher. So uh, what's your take on the sophomores uh, kind of invading the parking lot? You know, from my perspective, I, uh, I don't really get affected by that a whole lot. I have a personal parking spot, and if they're in my spot, I'll just have them towed. That's nice. Mr. Vanderbilt. Really well. That's one yeah. way to get rid of That's them. right, yeah. that's right. Don't park in people's spots. Yeah, that's, that's the whole moral of this video, I think, is just stay in your own spot. Correct. Correct. Thank you. Have Thank you, day. you Thank too. You Hi everyone, I'm with uh, gym teacher and uh, ex-trainer in Wyoming, uh, Mr. Sharon Weber, to discuss uh, how the underclassmen are kind of invading the parking lot and taking spots and running into people. What's your take on that? Um, I haven't seen any underclassmen hit anybody in the parking lot as of yet, 
Um, they have, uh, not they, but some students have parked in my spot before. Mm. Um, I park them in when they do that and uh, Mr. Van de Vriede, uh, Officer Van de Vriede, I should say, gets uh, promptly notified uh, and then uh, I, I, if that's going to happen this year, they're going to get the boot. Um, as far as I understand, we got a nice boot for their car. Yeah, so, that's the best so. way to handle it is go to an uh, officer. Definitely. So any, any, anything else you want to say about this topic? Or? Um, I've never lived in Wyoming. Um, I went to school in Montana, just oh. to clarify for the record. Oh yeah, the, you, I always get those two mixed up sometimes. Yeah. They're different states, they're quite large. Yeah. Thanks for sitting down with us and uh, have a good rest of your day. Awesome. Peace. I will. Come to the conclusion that these sophomores are running rampant in the, in the parking lots of Sartell High School. It's absolutely insane. A lot of car dings, a lot of crashes, a lot of people parking in the wrong spots. We, we've heard it from the students, we've heard it from the teachers. It's absolutely insane out there. It's an absolute jungle for sure out there, man. It's crazy. It's, it's wild. No parking lots. Everyone's trying to leave at the same time. You know, you just gotta be, you gotta be efficient and. When you get out, you know, you can't, you can't cut people you gotta off. Stay blessed. Yeah. And I'm really glad that people watch this. I mean, the first problem <laughs> is awareness. So everyone that watches this, hopefully they slow down in the parking lot. They don't cut in front of people. They just yeah. keep yeah. eyes on the road. I see a lot of texting in the parking lot. Can't That's have that. Really, know. You can't, no, nothing. nothing. Yeah, so nothing. I think this video is going to help a lot of people out in the parking lot. I, I'm really happy. You that know, we want to thank the teachers and staff, students. Sorry, sure. lover. Yeah. I think that. Great. Absolutely. Great talent. Just Great in front of the camera, and just everyone, everyone, everyone did an amazing job. Everyone did great. Yeah, we just want to thank. Thank, thank you to everybody. Yeah, bye. Bye bye. Saber TV signing off.